We got the Cavaliers and Celtics game one. Shout out to Flay. I can't watch it by myself. TNT is going to block. What it do, Flight Crew? FTC. Flight Team stand up. It may be May, but June is on the way. We got the Boston Celtics versus the Cleveland Cavaliers. Game one, round two of the Eastern Conference semifinals. The Celtics with Tatum, Brown, Derek White, Brazangas, Drew Holiday. Horford of Val, Pritchett, <laughs> and the rest are nobodies. The Cavs with Mitchell, Spidey, Garlic, Mobley, dude, Laverta Cares, Dr. Seuss, Dr. Seuss, who's Dr. Seuss? Josh Childers Jr. The playoff. Oh, he he called Jared and Josh Childress Jr. Yeah, I don't know who Josh Childress is. I was born in 2018, 2000. I don't know nothing about no Josh Childress. Check it out. Celtics are starting out at home. Number one ranked versus the fourth ranked. Here's the Eastern Conference. Let me actually sleep. But he's like an old head, bro, when it comes to basketball. He has that. He remembers the old school players, but can't can barely remember the new new players unless they're good. Standings. I should have looked at this. The past this. So here's the Eastern Conference. All right. I mean, it's like we, we reacted to the last one yesterday, the uh, the Knicks and the uh, the Pacers game. Or no, not the Pacers. Oh yeah, the Pacers. Cause I'm thinking of the Bucks, but scratch it. Whole different game. Celtics, Cavs. We here. Jalen Brown. Y'all put your predictions Dang, down below right now. By Tatum. The Tatum send up. We here. Oh, I got the Celtics in five. I get a Cleveland in the game. Give them a five. Just to be nice, just to make their day. Y'all put your predictions down below right now. Who do y'all got in the series? Uh, I got the Celtics in five games. Yeah. Cavs with no LeBron James in the big 2024. No chance. Against the number one team. If the Cavs do upset the Celtics, though. He's been such a blessing for the trade everybody. Very yep, trade everybody. By Jalen Brown. You know, very few guys can do whatever's necessary in terms of impact. Swing pass to a 10 day. Bottoms. Knocks down a much needed triple there. Mitchell. Spidey. Tris. Bald head superpowers activate. Why was that a surprise? Ever since, bro, ever since he went, boy, he started That's hooping. He hit his leg. Yo, am I tripping? I have not seen Josh Childers Jr. for a minute. Swing pass to a 10 day contract. Yeah, he's looking like, hey, looking like a 20 day now. Hey, fly, he's getting another 10 day contract after this performance. He already hit two threes. Got Derek. Damn. I am. It's not much yet. Brown. Brown. Off the glass. Man got 11 points already. Dang. Mitchell. He ain't kind of. He can't play game one. Alert. 21-20. That's green. Spidey pull up. They got the lead. 23-21. There you go, bro. Using that left hand, I see. Got sent. Got a geography teacher with the block. We <laughs> caught him geography teacher. With the right hand. Not a surprise. Bro, why did he call? Why does Flay call every white person a teacher? Is that my assistant principal? Is that my geography teacher? Is that my history teacher in middle school? Brown, he call every white player that he don't know. He call every white player that he don't know a teacher or a principal. And not a surprise. Just a masterful start for Brown. He's got got Tatum. Ooh. Is he all right? Tatum. Post fade. Ooh, oh. I make those in my sleep. Reverse running. Mitchell. Mitchell he got right through Holiday. Dang, Holiday. That's what I just said. Dang. Maybe he hype you up like you the greatest defender of all time. Dang, you don't let dudes run right past you. Hanging on that rim. Don't get attacked. Mitchell's getting double teamed already. 10 day contractor. Bottoms. His three points oh, and that's some Morris, too. The shooting percentage now has dipped down to got Pritchett. In the corner like a prostitute. You know where Flight got that from? In the corner like a prostitute. He got that from Gento. If you guys didn't know, he got that from Gento. Mitchell? Gento used to say that. 
Oh, spin move. Drew, three on two, fast breaking. All the way, coast to coast with the lefty jelly. Do that for Team USA this summer. Dr. Seuss. Oh, he caught him, Dr. Seuss. Did Max Seuss. Dr. Seuss. Old man. Old man Horford. He didn't, the commentators even caught him old. Ten day contractor? Thirty day. And he's a thirty day contract player you, now. He made three threes. Casuals becoming alive in the playoffs. They playing like they got something to prove. I mean, they trying to stay on the team. I don't blame them. Garland has he scored anything? Finally, for his bucket the game. All right, he's not missing, bro. White is not missing. Yeah, Dr. Seuss. Floater? Nope. Mobley. Patience is key. Tatum. Ballin. Dang. Spider! And one! Top of the third. Dang, I sing. Dang, Spider! You gotta do better than that, Spidey! Top of the third. Hey, I sent. Tatum with a rare block. Swing, swing. Swing, you know, Jalen Brown's a ball. Swing, swing. Holiday. Ball movement was a key in that possession. We got surprised he passed the ball. Oh, my goodness. This man's not missing. I don't know that Cleveland can defend them any better. They end up having two contested threes. Wow. Push off, kind of. Mitchell. Spidey. Leaving this down by 20. Holiday. White. He's going to shoot another three, ain't he? Yes, he is. That left him open. Wow. Garden left finds the laces and connects. So it's an 11 point game, second three of the night for Garland. Holy moly. Remember, you guys see me Jaylen squinting Brown sometimes. It's just Justin. lights Ooh. too bright. Ooh. Long day of being in the lights. You got to wait for travel. Good, 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 good jam. Derek? What? Yo. What? Derek White? See you, Mobley. Hand in his face, it don't matter. Yo, bruh, this man went bald and I got superpowers for going bald, bruh. That's crazy. Dog, when the hell did he get good like this? That's bro? what I'm saying. Where did he get sent? Because hit a contested threes. You send him to a free throw line, he can't make a free throw. You let him take a mid range, you can't make a regular mid range. But he had no problem knocking down a contested three. Whoop de do. Like, I don't even know. Like, he's getting, he's getting too consistent where I can't even be pissed off no more. Bro, Slick becoming a second option over Brown. Dang, Spidey! You gotta go up and damn, he's getting old, bro. Oh, get that shit out of here. Derek? It's a Brown? Holiday. It's a Brown holiday. Tristan Thompson has checked into the game. He joins Ooh. Mitchell. Come on, Spidey. Redeem yourself. Pull up. There you go. There you go. Quiet at crowd. 82 to 70? Cavs, make this a better game. The fuck? This nigga, T bro, Tristan Thompson has got to be the top five, not only NBA bust of vaults. First of all, let me look this up. When he, because I can't even really, can you even call him a bust? Was he even like, you know what I'm saying, on like that to even begin with? Yeah, man, I'm taking like, PEDs, bro, flight. I want you guys to realize this dude is seven foot. He's dated one of the Kardashians. He's seven like, feet tall, bro. flight. And he, uh, I'm finding you decide right now. What, what was he drafted? Bro, the first thing you look up is literally like it shows his relationship versus NBA career. <laughs> NBA draft. Round one, pick four. Oh, yeah. Top five pick, and he averages career three points per game. Top five busts of all time. With that being said, bro, you have got to be also the top five worst centers in basketball history. Bro, like, nigga, you were getting trucked by Tatum. You didn't even get trucked. He just fell down. Footwork. He just fell down on his ass. Nah, bro. Bro, you taking PEDs for this, bro? 
for Tam to just do that to you? This man, T-Jazz. I mean, uh, not T-Jazz. He came up saying T-Jazz. Shout out to T-Jazz. T-Jazz is a hooper, hooper. I'm going to drop him off in June, by the way, for that rematch. You better. You almost won last time. You were just ass juice. Derek, damn. Damn three. This man, this man is doing. Bro, you were June, by the way. Bro, Derek White. Bro, bro, Derek White got so he started stealing my moves. What the hell? Now he's stealing my moves. Derek White with a damn three. I can't believe it, man. What the fuck? Oh, geography teacher with the scoop. What happened? Well deserved rest here. What the fuck? Oh, Damn, Chester Thompson. Got dunked on by a geography teacher? Under a minute. Ooh. Okay. Pritchett. At the buzzer. I'm here with it. Look like me on 2K. The buzzer. He look like me on 2K. Okay. I'm here with it. Yo, we don't give a fuck about what this coach says. Show the game, please. <laughs> Old man Horford. Yeah, you're going outside. Yeah, 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 you're going outside, Cleveland. I'm sorry. I'm going outside. You let an old man Horford do this to you? I get if he was back in Atlanta, Al Horford, but Celtic Al Horford, 2024, big 2024? Al Horford do this to you? Levert, come on now. You're better than this. He scored on you too? Horford, big body. Bro, come on, bro. This dude's 30, 30, 30, 30,000 years old. 37,000 years old doing this to you. That's some pride. And down by. Brown stepping back. 20! Top of the key. You gotta shoot. Y'all gotta shoot. Oh, they say no shot clock cheese for you. Come on. Old man Horford. Balling like it's back in 2010. Balling like it's 2010. Old man Horford. Got Mobley. This man's pump faking. Can they take that next step? Got to the NBA Finals a couple of years ago. Is this the group that can finally hang Banner 18 here? Damn. Brown. But why is Brown still in the game with Holiday and White? It's Mobley coming alive. That's his third field goal in their last four trips. Mobley. Mobley. This is a try not to fall asleep game. Holy fuck. Yeah. Yes, man. I mean, the Warriors, <laughs> let's be honest. We would be giving the Celtics a better competition. Matter of fact, we knocked these niggas out the finals two years ago. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. NBA. Remember, hey, hey, hey. I remember the last time Warriors was in TG, TD Garden. Bro, ESPN, bro. They had the ESPN analysts wanted to quit. They made Stephen. They wanted Stephen. They was damn near about to quit. Bro, Perk was damn near about to quit. Last time Warriors in TD Garden, bro. Y'all blew him out the water, looking like me on 2K, bro. You thought it was a 2K game? It was like 100 to like 50. Hey, NBA knows they swinging at the air right now, bro. They can have five times ticket sales, five times the viewership. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. You're right with the Warriors, cause Curry. He's right, though. He's right about that. They want to give the Warriors a harder schedule and have the Cavs and the Big 2024 in the second round. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> these Cavs shouldn't even last against an AAU team. I think RWE can knock these niggas out, man. <laughs> Cam! Coach Cam! How are y'all the fourth-ranked team and y'all can't even keep this with a five-point game, bro? Damn! Oh, Bridget. Damn! Damn! I ain't going to... Slay! Smells about, I didn't know you better on sports. Cavs completely gave up. Mitchell's on the bench. They got Tristan Thompson carrying right now for the Cavs. Mm -hmm. That lucky ass shot, nigga. That PED is kicking in, flight. That PED kicking in. Oh, I forgot Porzingis is out. Oh, yeah, that's right. Give us some Porzingis. The Cavs are going to be at an advantage because they're still going to be. Bro. This game is ass. Holy. Dang. 45-point blowout. I'm not going to lie to you. We're going to have to see game two. I'm still staying what I said. Six-game series. Um, Maybe the Cavs might get lucky next game and have a better game. But, bro, the Celtics just was way too dominant.
they had their entire starting lineup out with like four or five minutes left in the fourth quarter. I mean, like Mitchell, he went off. Amazing game. 33. 33. What else can you ask for Mitchell? And to be even fair, like, I mean, Garlic could have really had more points, but if you really think about it, Garlic is really, this is the amount of points he averages, 14 to 17 points per game. I've always said that Garlic is, I've always tried to label him a consistent, cool, casual, but, you know, the hype beast of this NBA generation wants me to label him as an all-star, and I'm going to unfortunately have to put Garlic right back, back down to the consistent, casual um, you know what I'm saying at this point. Um, you know, the reason why he's an all-star is because, let's be honest, it's a different type of time period. You know, he's able to chuck threes more in the regular season and have a couple of... Let me guess. Let me guess. Dudes like Stephon Marbury would have ran you out the league. You would have been crying at the practice. He would have been crying at the practice. There is gone. You were back in the early 2000s. Stephon Marbury would have ran you out. 35-point games. No. But if we're being fair, Garlic is a nice second option. He's not an all-star, bro. And this is the exact points that he averages, 14 to 17 points. You can't really expect him to put up 20, 25, and 30 points. Bro, he's 6'1". He doesn't he, – I can bench press more than him. You know, he doesn't really have like a, you know, a driving type of a game. He has to rely, rely off of his three-point shot. And if he has a good defender on him, I'm pretty sure assuming he had Brown or he had Jiru Hade or even Derek White, three decent defenders, that knocks him out of the game. He doesn't have – you know, come on. You have to rely off Mitchell – and he, Mitchell is not yeah. the team like the Celtics <laughs> yeah. in a seven-game series. You know, yeah, you kind of right. Garland didn't have a good series against the Magic, bro. He was struggling shooting. They went to seven with the Magic. You know, the Magic were good. But you know, no one expected that. Like, let alone that series on NBA TV for a reason. If they even get that many chances. I, I mean, I don't see the Cavs, honestly, winning even. I'm going to still stand on what I said. I hope that it's a six-game series. Hopefully, we can still get a good series. You know what I'm saying? We nobody wants to see nobody get swept out in the playoffs. That's just make shit. I boring. do. And I do. I do. I don't like these teams. I do. I want them to sweep everyone. I want everyone to taste the broom. No, no, but I don't know, man. Uh, what do you guys have to say? What y'all take on this? I was gonna say, to be fair, if you're really looking at the Cavs, kind of didn't even play too bad. Everybody in the starting lineup, other than Dr. Seuss, I think he didn't eat his green eggs and ham this morning. <laughs> Dr. Seuss, two for eight. Garland went six for 15. That's not going to get it done, Garland. But he scored over 10 plus points. Um, you know, a couple people had eight plus, five plus rebounds and shit. Um, the Celtics are just way too much of a better team. You have Jason Tatum, you have Jalen Brown, you have two superstars slash all stars, and then you have Derek White, who I don't know where the fuck this nigga came from. Me either. Unfortunately, I have to damn near borderline label him all star. I hate to even admit it. Derek White is borderline an all-star. I'd rather have seen Derek White made the all-star game than Darius Garlic. Garlic made the all-star, right? I don't remember. But I know he made it the, the year before. Um, I know he made it the year before. Um, and how I remember is because I remember, when, if you do not remember, it was, um, I had the long story short. I had that little collab thing with uh, Drewski. Uh, and, and, and with uh, Luke Kennard, with the uh, it was like this Mountain Dew. He was looking at like top plays and shit of like you know throughout the NBA and stuff, and basically like having a like commentary about it and shit. Um, but no, before I actually like got to like the um the building that I went to to do the you feel me like the collab and shit. It was it, it was during All Star Week. That's what it was, bro. No, I had a couple of cast friends friendly press me saying you need to give Garlic his credit. He's a finally an All Star. Bro, he's demoted right back down to consistent casual, um, which is not bad. Pressing out know, flight. Like, a consistent casual averages 14 to 17 points usually, but you're not an all-star. With that being said, Derek White is better than Garlic, and he outplaying him. He's outplaying him um, throughout these playoffs. Brown with the 32 points. Garlic with, uh, I mean, Derek White with 25. Tatum with only 18. He didn't even have to try this game because they got subbed out middle yep. of the fourth quarter. This series is over with, man. Celtics is way too talented to lose to the Cavs. I mean, maybe if y'all had LeBron, y'all would have had a solid He's chance, done. but y'all might as well just throw in a towel, man. Man, throw in a towel. to Cancun because this series oh, is I think up. he's working at the right. Jamal Murray situation. Being said, sometimes I have to do, like, actually last night's game, I had to do, like, seven, eight different edits so my video wouldn't get copyrighted and shit because, you know, we have 
um, the, the sponsorship and the license and the permission to react yeah. to the NBA. That's my problem right now. But sometimes, literally, like, 10-second clips, I don't know, it's weird as fuck. Like, the NBA literally blocks certain clips of the game because I guess it shows too much of, like, a full, like, actual sport game of it or whatever. It, it, it tracks too much of the audio broadcast. With that being said, we react to long story short of Jamal Murray throwing. I am aware he did throw that heat pack. People were like, bro, you sold on the clip. No, I seen it. And literally 10 seconds of the clip was blocked entire of the entire video you know what i'm saying so hmm do i sit there and do i and usually what happens with that i have to usually wait until the next morning and sometimes the claims team don't usually get into the office at about like 11 to 12 noon i know you guys watch as soon as the game ends the reactions to be out and i tried to provide for the ecstasy brothers since it's so long so i had to edit it out but in the future if you guys see clips edited out it's because you know what i'm saying it would have been blocked copyright and i have to finesse it and edit it out but Jamal Murray lost. That's my, my that's my problem. Okay, y'all already right, showed y'all this. Jamal threw the thing, threw the heating pad, got fined one hundred k. And I didn't know David Stern would have suspended him. All the old analysts would have said that David Stern would have suspended him. Adam Silver served. Adam Silver served. Same threat and threw a heating pad, which is borderline attempted murder towards the Timberwolves. Bro, a heating pad is crazy. Just kidding. If you don't get my humor at this point in Big 2024, I don't know what to tell you. But the NBA hit him with a $100,000 fine, which in all respect, and this is about maybe $5.25 to Jamal Murray um, because of this. So, hey, Adam Silver will be hitting his bank account up this weekend and will be partying it up. Jamal Murray don't do something like that again. All right, man, y'all comment down below. Who do y'all fully got in the Cavs in the Celtics series?